Hi everyone, it's Amy, and I have some happy mail here, and this is from Intelligent Bella. Hi, thank you so much. We're doing sort of a surprise happy mail swap. We're not really calling it a swap because we don't have any rules on what we have to send each other, but we're kind of just exchanging happy mail, and uh, Melanie, you know mine's going to be a little delayed because we have so much going on at the moment, but um, I did want to mention, and Ashley too, if you're watching this video, I am going to be in your area, well sort of, I'm going to be in the Sarasota area in a few weeks, um, so I don't know, I guess it's still probably a good hour or so away from you guys, but I thought I'd throw it out there, I don't know how much time we're going to have, but maybe we can meet up. Um, anyway, so I just opened the wrapping and there's this very pretty box inside. So I'm going to try to work around the camera here. And there is a card. So I will open this. And thank you so much for sending this. And it came actually in really good condition. Oh, this is so pretty. I don't know if you've stamped that or came like that. Oh, some vintage. Okay, so thank you so much. And I will link Melanie's channel down below, of course. Look at this pretty card. So I love that. Okay, so let's see. Ooh, so she sent me some pretty bling. That will come in handy. Oh, these are really cute, these brads. I love these. Definitely use those for flower centers. And I think my little one wants to come in. Yes, dear. Oh, Melanie, look. Okay, I'm going to have to show you. Um, look, at there's first there's this little bag. I'm getting ahead of myself. And she has these um, cute little wood uh, veneers in here. There's a mustache and glasses. How cute. And a Polaroid frame. And look at what she sent me. Okay, so Melanie and I both love vintage strawberry shortcake. And um, after I get this open, I will show you my collection, Melanie, because I'm not sure if you've seen it. So, but I noticed in one of her videos, she had a um, vintage strawberry shortcake drinking glass on her desk. And I was like, ah! Because I collect vintage strawberry shortcake too. Look how cute this postcard is. And I was really lucky to find all of my strawberry shortcake things at the thrift store. And I haven't seen anything like that in a while. So I struck when I could and that was good. So I've had these things for a few years. But these pretty clothes pins. Love them. Okay, so let's see. Okay. Tissue paper. Ooh, bling. Look at all this bling. Ah, oh, thank you. Okay, oh, oh, there's filigrees in here too. Oh, good. I can always use those. I think I've been out of stuff like this for a while. Really pretty. There's butterflies and little charms. Oh, thank you so much. I love that. Okay, so let's see what's in here. Where did you get this? It's 2014, but it's it's like vintage style. Oh, that's so cute. I'll put it up with my collection. So let me pick you up real quick and show you. My room's a little messy. And then I'll show you a quick haul I did yesterday from Joanne Fabrics. Okay, so um, this... Okay. This is my... <laughs> Vintage Strawberry Shortcake Collection. I have a metal tray and that jar and that carafe. And those are my Vintage Strawberry Shortcake dolls. I love Strawberry Shortcake. Yes. And my friend made this a little strawberry heart for me. So, yeah, that's my Strawberry Shortcake Collection. So I will... Definitely add um, this cute, cute little cup to my collection. Thank you so much. I love everything. And I am looking forward to creating for you. 
and putting together some goodies for you. So let me clean that up. I love this postcard too. I'm definitely going to display that. I love it and the card. Thank you so much, Melanie. Okay, so I went to Joann's yesterday. And I'll just show you quickly what I got. Um, I bought these cards, linen closet, um, because they're pretty neutral, so I thought I could decorate them, you know, with, with any tilde papers or any papers. And this box was $4. And let's see. There are 40 cards and envelopes. So I guess that means 20 of each. I'm guessing, unless there's 40 of each. But yeah, so I got that for four bucks. I thought that was not bad. I got a new glue gun. This isn't really the one I wanted, but it is pink, and mine is so nasty. I have that big um, one that sits on a base, and it's supposed to be cordless, and it was like $32.99, and it's so nasty. So I thought it's time to retire that one or do something, clean it up maybe. But um, I thought I'd use that one for a while. It'll be a little cuter. And I wanted to, I was out of Mod Podge, so I decided to try this one to see if I liked it, because maybe it'll be a little less messy because it's a little squirt top instead of, you know, the big jar. And because I was enabled by Laura from the Robin Laura and my friend Marissa, a creative young mama, I had to buy these buttons. They are super cute. And then I also got these. And I got some other, what else did I get? Oh, I got some yarn, but that's in a different room. So that is my haul from Joann's from yesterday. And um, I'll let you guys know if I like this or not as much as Mod Podge. And that is it. I hope everyone is having a great weekend. And um, I so love this and I love everything. Thank you so much, Melanie. And um, I'll talk to you and Ashley on Facebook and see if there is any way that we can meet up um, when I'm over on the West Coast. But I don't know. It might be a little too far for you. We might be crunched for time. But that would be cool. But one of these days we will all get together, us Florida girls. And... Um, yeah, I hope everyone's doing great, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.